This video introduces the OPC UA communication in the air management system. OPC UA stands for Open Platform Communication, Unified Architecture. In basic terms, OPC UA allows for data exchange between various suppliers and manufacturers, which can be used, plotted, or interpreted by many different software platforms. We can use OPC UA to monitor data from the system. However, to enable control, we first need to set DIP switch 1 in the setting 1 section to on. OPC UA has communication specifications and limits. This table shows the specifications. We can see the limits in communication for OPC UA here. An OPC UA certificate may be required, depending on the client used. However, if a certificate is not installed it is still possible to use OPC UA, there will be an option to accept a temporary certificate. Clicking on OPC UA, here we are able to set the port number, discovery server URL, buffer sample rate and size. Entering a discovery server URL, will give access to the correct timestamp. In the tag tab, the OPC UA nodes can be configured to send and receive up to 255 tags. An adjustable data buffer is available for up to 1800 bytes of data. It is possible to import and export tags here in order to store or save them for future use. In this example, we are going to select the following tags for measurement, flow, pressure, standby, and isolation. We will refer to the process data map in the operation manual for the correct allocation. When selecting the data required, we have the option to record this in a buffer. Ticking the checkboxes, allows for data to be stored in the configured buffer for faster sampling rates. The write enable checkboxes will allow any outputs to be written by OPC UA. We have the option to select if the data is big or little endian. This animation shows an example of the difference between the two. This is big endian. And this is little endian. In our example, we are going to use UA Expert as OPC UA client. We will now demonstrate how to connect to the OPC UA server. Open UA Expert and click on the plus symbol. Locate Custom Discovery and double click on Add Server. Enter the URL, IP address and click OK. In the menu bar, click on the connect icon. A credential window will appear. Enter admin, which is the default username and password. Click OK when done. In the address space, you will now find a newly created root folder. Navigate the menu to parameter set. Here you can view all the configured nodes that were selected on the system and drag them to the data access view panel for easy monitoring. Thank you. This concludes this video on OPC UA communication in the air management system.